Welcome to our channel. Today, we're going to be talking about the top 5 best bike mini pumps on the market. Whether you're a seasoned cyclist or just starting out, having a reliable mini pump is a must have accessory for any ride. In this video, we'll be taking a closer look at the features, pros, and cons of each pump, so you can make an informed decision when it comes to choosing the best one for you. From compact and lightweight designs to durable and efficient pumps, we've got you covered. If you want more information, and updated pricing on the products mentioned, be sure to check the links in the description box below. Take a quick note all products have very good reviews on Amazon. Now let's get into the video. We will start with the Topeak Unisex Adult Joe Blow Ace. The Topeak Joe Blow Ace DX is a high-performing bike pump that stands out among many others due to its impressive capabilities. On test, the pump was able to inflate a 700 by 25 c tubeless tire to 100 psi in just 11 powerful strokes, making it the ideal choice for quickly and easily inflating your tires. However, it is important to note that getting much more air into the tire with each stroke became a bit of a challenge once the pressure reached beyond 60 psi. Despite this, the pump is still an excellent performer, with a bleed valve that allows air to escape from the tire making it easier to get the perfect pressure. The Topeak brand is highly regarded in the cycling community, much like Garmin GPSs are considered to be among the best cycling computers. However, one of the downsides of the Topeak Joe Blow Ace DX is its price. For the cost, it does not offer the capability to inflate tubeless tires, which can be a drawback for some riders. Additionally, the huge visual gauge on the pump means it has a large footprint, making it a bit challenging to store neatly at home. Next up, we have Lazine Digital Road Drive Bicycle. The Lazine Digital Drive Mini Pump offers an accurate and reliable solution for cycling enthusiasts looking to inflate their tires on the go. With its digital gauge, this pump provides precise tire pressure readings, and its maximum inflation capacity of 90 PSI is sufficient to handle most cycling situations whether you're on a remote road or in a more urban environment. During testing, the hard-wearing aluminum construction of the pump proved to be both quick and efficient, providing riders with the desired PSI level in a timely manner. This pump's measurements were also cross-checked with a traditional gauge and were found to be highly accurate. However, it should be noted that the Lazine Digital Drive Mini Pump is larger and heavier than some other bike pumps on the market such as the iPump Twist and the Topeak Micro Rocket Owl. This may make it less convenient for some riders, especially those looking for an ultralight and compact option to carry with them. In terms of cost, the Lazine Digital Drive may seem a bit pricier compared to other options, but it is worth considering that it eliminates the need to purchase a separate pressure gauge. However, if you're looking to inflate your tires beyond the pump's maximum volume, this may not be the best choice for you. Overall, this is a great choice for riders looking for an accurate and reliable bike pump, but you should carefully weigh the pros and cons before making a decision, especially if you prioritize compactness and lightweight in your cycling gear. Up next, we have iPump Twist. The iPump Twist Mini Pump is an innovative product that has caught the attention of many cyclists due to its claim of being the world's lightest bike air pump. While it may not have the highest scores in tests, it still appeals to many riders and is worth considering. With a weight of just 25 grams, the eye pump twist is a featherweight that is hard to beat. In comparison, even the best CO2 inflators struggle to match its weight, and it is a more environmentally friendly option since it is reusable. The pump features a full carbon fiber construction and comes with a thin Presta-only hose that is pulled out of the handle when it is needed. This design helps to keep the weight down and makes it as light as most energy gels. However, during testing, it was found that 200 strokes only achieved a pressure of 60 psi, which required a lot of effort, and the body of the pump became quite hot. In conclusion, the iPump Twist Mini Pump may be a good option for those who prioritize saving weight and space, and only need it for emergency situations. But for those who require a more efficient pump, it may not be the best choice, as it requires a lot of effort to achieve a reasonable pressure and becomes hot to the touch during use. 
The next product on our list is the Topeak Micro Rocket L. The Lifeline Performance Road Mini Pump is a great cycling accessory for those who want to maintain the right balance between a lightweight pump and one that is effective in its function. The pump is designed with a sleek aluminium body, making it both lightweight and durable. It is easy to carry, whether you put it in your jersey pocket or saddlebag, as it measures just 160 mm in length and weighs a mere 65 grams. In addition, this mini pump comes with a frame mounting kit, allowing you to secure it to either side of your bottle cage, or you can opt for an additional centerline mount for extra convenience. This makes it perfect for those who are already carrying a lot of gear and want to maximize the use of their available space. However, one downside to the Lifeline Performance Road Mini Pump is that it may not be as powerful as some of the other pumps on the market. Although the company claims that it can reach 160 psi, in testing it was only able to get to just above 60 psi after 200 strokes on a 23 mm tire. While this may be enough to get you home or back to the race headquarters, it falls short when compared to the Lazine Carbon Drive Light Mini Pump. Despite this, the pump is still comfortable to use and its small size makes it a great option for those who are looking for a compact pump. Lastly, our best overall best bike mini pump is the Lazine Carbon Drive Light Hand Pump. The Lazine Carbon Drive Light Mini Pump is an ideal accessory for cyclists who are looking for a way to effectively pump up their tires without adding extra weight to their bikes. With a carbon construction, it is one of the lightest options on the market, and it is compatible with both Presta and Schrader valves, making it a versatile choice. The pump comes with a hose extension that can be stored within the barrel, which is convenient for cyclists who are looking for a compact and portable solution. The pump is 17 cm long, making it shorter than some of its competitors, such as the Lifeline Performance Road Mini Pump, but despite its size, it has a surprising capacity for performance. During tests, the pump was able to reach 100 psi with just 200 strokes, making it one of the most effective pumps in its class. However, there are a few drawbacks to this pump. The biggest downside is that the pump can become uncomfortable to hold after pumping up the tires to a high side, which can be inconvenient for some cyclists. Additionally, the pump can be awkward to attach to the valve, which can be frustrating for some users. Despite these downsides, the Lazine Carbon Drive Light Mini Pump is still a great option for cyclists who are looking for a high-performance pump. It features a pressure relief button that allows you to release excess air if needed, and it is small enough to fit in your pocket or attach to your bottle cage. Although it is not the most affordable option on the market, it offers an excellent combination of functions and performance, making it one of the best mini bike pumps available. Thanks for watching and that's all for now. If we help you out in any way please hit the like and subscribe button. Links to all products we've talked about are in the description down below. I hope to see you guys in the next video.